Every single one of the attacks uh, in Europe over the last 18 months or so had an online dimension, uh, either through incitement to carry out an attack, sometimes instructions on how to do it, and often glorification afterwards. Uh, and terrorist content is uh, too present on too many platforms. Uh, Europol are working with more than 150 platforms in trying to tackle terrorist content online. Uh, the UK Home Office did a study uh, last year and they found that Daesh and their supporters were using more than 400 platforms to push out this material. And there's been a shift in the nature of the attacks that we've been facing. We've discussed that here before. Uh, we've been facing more so-called lone actor attacks. And I'm afraid that too often uh, the people who are carrying out those attacks have been radicalized by exposure to online content. And the potential damage caused by this terrorist content rises dramatically every hour it remains online. So what are we proposing to do? What are we proposing today that is different? We are proposing to create three new obligations. First, uh, a new instrument, a new legal instrument, uh, removal orders. We're making it mandatory for platforms to act within one hour when they receive a removal order from the police or judicial authorities and take the material in question down. Secondly, if you're a platform, if your platform is being used to spread terrorist content, then you will have an obligation to make use of proactive, me proactive measures to detect content and prevent it from either being uploaded in the first place or reappearing. And third, uh, an obligation on the member states, that the member states need to have a dedicated law enforcement capacity in place with the resources to effectively detect terrorist content and to issue uh, removal orders. Now, none of this is anywhere near censorship. We're not talking about some gray area of, of difficult judgment. Terrorist content, material that incites or advocates committing terrorist acts, promotes or glorifies a terrorist group, or provides instruction in how to carry out an attack, is illegal. It's illegal online, just as it is illegal offline, and it needs to be removed.